me, Lonnie Clark, Nuts for Art. I'm out here on the Willamette River again, going for a walk uh, out by the river. I'm actually on the side of the woods. Uh, I feel compelled to put up a video for us to have this discussion about uh, the meaning of it all. Like, we are... Obviously, people following my channel all recognize that we're super screwed. That we live in a culture where we can't stop the nuclear industry. We can't stop the pharmaceutical industry. We can't stop the big business, the mega billionaires, from really using and abusing us and destroying our families at their whim anytime they want. So the question is, how do we get through in life? How do we make it through and how do we pursue this? I mean, in today's world, we have a lady, Gina Haspel, who's going to run the CIA, who had a hand not only in torturing people and waterboarding people, but she had a hand in destroying the documents from the CIA, and they want her to be the head of the CIA. This is who Trump thinks is going to protect America. Like, I don't know what America they think they're protecting us from. Uh, the America that wants to find out the truth about who's really running the country. But I have to say, I am blown away that people think Trump is fighting the big state still. The deep state, I think that's what they call it. Trump is part of the deep state. He is not fighting them. He's a chump. They are setting him up. They held him by his first piece of property. They are using him. And frankly, uh, they're working to destroy our country and our democracy, whatever that was whatever we thought we had, because frankly, here we are thinking that we had a democracy, while every single one of us are now beginning to realize that the water is all polluted, uh, the air is polluted, in fact, they're continuing to pollute us, and this whole thing about the geoengineering, there's a big fight, you know, between educated people, whether it's real or not real, all the while we're getting chemicals sprayed down on us. Uh, there's a fight about whether nuclear radioactivity is healthy for you or not. Like, will it kill you or not? There's not actually a fight. This is all just science. So, we're living in an idiocracy. It's just beyond comprehension when, you know, you go to a pro-nuclear page and you make a comment about how nuclear causes diabetes, schizophrenia, and they're like, oh, that's rubbish. No, it's not rubbish. It's all scientific data. In fact, I have books by John Goffman, if anybody wants them, that I can mail to you. They have not been disavowed. All of the studies show the same thing. So we're living in a time where the people who are running the show have no regard for human health or anything. And that's not news to you guys because you've been watching my channel now for several years. But the question is, how do we, like, what do we have to do to get people to give a rat's ass about our country and about our planet and about their families? I still have not figured that one out. Uh, obviously, because I'm sitting here just on YouTube talking to myself. <laughs> There's a handful of people who watch me regularly. And by the way, I really appreciate it. It's really nice to know that there's a community of people out there who sort of share my same ideas and values. It's so... It's frustrating because the hard part is, is you know... I'm personally sick of listening to the details of how the nuclear reaction works and how it destroys. All what we really do know is that nuclear kills. And we don't have to have, uh, you know, what do they call that, uh, second-day quarterback, you know. I, I personally don't need somebody telling me how it all works, and I don't want to hear about it. I'm sick of it. I'm sick of the lies. I'm sick of all of it. I'm sick of them moving people back into Fukushima moving people back into, uh, look what they did here in the United States. You think Fukushima is any different? Look at Rocky Flats. Look at Hanford. Look at uh, Three Mile Island. Three Mile Island melted down and they didn't move jack shit out. So, that's why I come out here every day to remind me this. That helps keep me strong. Helps me remember. So, I'm going to upload this uh, and I encourage everyone to put your courage feet on. We'll talk to you later. Thanks for watching and thanks for thumbs up. Bye.